Sam Greenfield is an awkward, orphaned teenager who has lately been ejected from her foster home, much to the dismay of her younger companion Hazel, who is hoping to be adopted soon. Sam Greenfield's life has been marked by disaster on a daily basis. After sharing a panini with a black cat one evening, she finds a penny that she intends to give to Hazel for her collection of other good luck charms to aid in her adoption. Sam discovers that her luck has substantially improved since receiving the penny the following day. She promptly loses the penny, though, as she unintentionally flushes it down the toilet. Sam finds the cat again and tells him what occurred as she laments her mistake. The cat then chastises Sam for losing the penny. Sam is shocked and follows the cat into the land of luck, where leprechauns and other creatures bring luck to people on earth, through a gateway. The cat, Bob, informs Sam that he needs the penny to travel and that if anyone finds out he lost it, he will be exiled. Sam and Bob agree to exchange the penny for another one from the penny depot so that Hazel might use it before giving it back to Bob. Sam sneaks into the land of luck wearing clothes while Bob uses a button from Sam to pose as a penny belonged to Jerry, Bob's personal leprechaun. Sam discovers along the way that a dragon controls good luck and that the land of luck's underworld controls bad luck. Jerry employs a drone to find the missing penny on Earth after an incident at the penny depot reveals Sam's identity, but the drone gets lost in the in-between, a region straddling the good and bad luck worlds. Sam and Bob visit the in-between, which is run by Jeff, a unicorn. Jeff is in charge of the randomizer, another device that sends both good and bad luck into Earth, which feeds the bad luck operat, a device that prevents bad luck specs from staying. The couple are informed by Jeff that he has located the coin and returned it to the depot. Sam, unfazed, makes the decision to go see the dragon in the hopes of getting another penny. Before handing Sam a fresh penny, the dragon, who goes by the name of Babe, spends a few period expressing to her how much better things would be if everyone had luck. Sam, however, gives up her penny to save Bob from exile once he is discovered to have faked his trip penny. Sam and Bob, who still want to assist Hazel, decide to turn off the bad luck operat for a while in order to stop bad luck from entering the randomizer and give Hazel the luck she needs to be adopted but the unlucky specs begin to clog Jeff's equipment and obliterate the good. Sam pouts in regret after realizing that Hazel was not adopted as a result, finding that Bob is actually an unlucky English cat, and being exposed as a human. Bob apologizes and tells Sam that, because Sam is by her side, Hazel is the luckiest girl in the world. Sam recalls seeing some luck in bad luck land on her trip to the in-between and believes that things can be changed. They discover it in a tiki bar in Bad Luck, where the bartender, Rooty, a root monster who was formerly Bob's friend, offers them the jar of good luck they had been using. To create fresh good and bad luck stones, they bring it to Babe. Babe makes two good luck stones instead of one bad luck stone because she wants to make the world full of only good fortune. Sam informs Babe that individuals need terrible luck just as much as they need good luck before she can place them. Once she admits her error and lets Sam set the bad omen stone, everything goes back to normal and Sam witnesses Hazel eventually being adopted by a new family. Although Bob is given the option of staying at the Land of Luck, he chooses to move in with Sam. After a year on Earth, Hazel's family visits Sam and Bob after they've come to terms with their misfortune. Make sure that you've subscribed and turn on the notification for more updates. Thank you for watching.